And because of vibration, patient can give us positive sign. What's a positive sign? Pain. Originally, Pastor Natsky proposed many, many years ago, after this sign, collect the UV. And it's possible to see, for example, a uh, big amount of white blood cells, if we are talking about this process, after this Pastor Natsky said, but today, we don't use this collection of urine, only this sign. If it's positive, what should you write? If it's positive, for example, right side positive Pasternatsky test or sign. It's pain, patient will, will cry. <laughs> Clear? Maybe it's intensive pain. We're talking about pyogenesis, maybe diseases of kidney, pyelonephritis can give us this uh, positive Pasternatsky sign. Before, you can palpate this region. Before, you will inspect this region. It should be symmetrical lumbar region, no? Uh, enlargement of one of the parts, yes. After that, kidney palpation. Can be standing position of patient, none of all of us. And you use one hand to fix lumbar region, and after that, you go in. But abdomen is very, abdomen is very strong for palpation. That's why we prefer this supine position with relaxation of abdominal muscles. You can use chair, yes, and after that, close it to me. And here will be uh, like a desk for this lumbar region, normal position. And after that, you are staying, uh, maybe space between uh, spina iliaca and costal arch. Oh, this is position. Uh, and after that, breathe in. And I'm going down, breathe out. I'm staying. I try to, to touch my second hand. Breathe in. I'm staying, breathe out, I'll go deeper, and after that, palpation. Of course, I didn't palpate this kidney. That's why, if you're talking about this method, really not everyday practice, we prefer ultrasound investigation to reveal changes. First supine, after that standing, after jumping, and it's possible to see maybe nephroptosis. And same with this, this uh, breathing out, and I will go deeper, and in, out, and I will go deeper, and palpation. Clear? Breathe in, out. No skin movement, nothing. I'm going in. Breathe in, and out, and palpation. That's all. Clear? That's for kidney. Mm. Yes. There's a, uh, there's a test for bowel movement, like for the kidneys, like we can press from the right hand, the kidney, and we can feel the kidney moving to the left hand that's under the skin. It's possible to use this test, especially if we have Enlarged. necroptosis, necropto not enlargement, but necroptosis. But in practice, if we are talking uh, about real practice, um, it should be a hectic patient Maybe to, to maybe very soft abdomen to feel something like this. If abdomen is not so soft, do you remember what can we do? It's hands up. Oh, legs flex, up. Flex. Uh, flex. Yes. That's why it's possible. Do you have questions about kidney palpation? Uh, excuse me. Yes. Madam, uh, we have. I have not glasses. Okay. Uh, auscultation of kidney vessels, practically. If you are talking about kidney vessel auscultation, it's not only kidney vessel auscultation. You should use stethoscope. You should use stethoscope. I think we have questions not about kidney vessel auscultation. We have questions about the auscultation of abdomen. Yes, yeah. that's yeah. why we use stethoscopes. Yes, and you will auscultate it oh, like this. You can press it. It's possible to auscultate this position of stethoscope, yes. It's possible to auscultate not kidney vessels only. For example, broken stethoscope. Other vessels too. And if you're talking about your case reports, uh, 
Do you remember uh, Vinagrad of Dura's year? Murmur or sign? A trauma sign? Trauma. Did you see? What is it? Easter. What is it? Uh, when we press the Easter part of the funeral. Archery, Archery, it's possible to hear murmur. What's the cause? Uh, aortic aortic vegetation. insufficiency, okay. regurgitation, aortic regurgitation. That's why different vessels, it's possible to auscopate. Femoral artery, for example. You press it and you'll hear murmur. Yes? If you are talking about, uh, for example, uh, abdominal aorta pathology, what's the pathology? Anivism. 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 Uh, can we hear something? Yes, yes. we can hear. We can hear murmurs. Yes. Okay. In practice, if we are talking about kidney arteries, we can auscultate it, and sometimes uh, it can be murmur. If patient is thin, it can be divine ultrasound too. It's possible to have, to find narrowing, stenosis. But we prefer additional methods. Angiography, for example, kidney arteries too, yes? Atherosclerotic narrowing for all the patient fibromuscular dysplasia for a younger patient. What's the uh, indication for this test for angiography of kidney arteries, for example? Uh, hypertension. Uh, we start to treat this hypertension. What's the result? Nothing, not good effect of treatment. And you suspect secondary hypertension. That's why this is our plan, finally because not all the cases can give us information. I'm talking about auscultation, can give us information. Okay, what else?